Shake it from the baby when it can you make it clap? Control me, better tap, tap, tap. I'm gripping on your hips, hit it from the back. Control me, better tap, tap, tap. Shake it from the baby, come on, shake it from me, yeah. Shake it from the baby, come on, shake it from me, yeah. Shake it from the baby, come on, shake it from me. Hey guys, welcome to your spicy vegans, and we're back. Hello! <laughs> I'm Sherry. I'm Derek. And I'm Kira. I miss seafood so much, guys. So today we're gonna try a couple things. We're gonna try to make some calamari out of hearts of palm. And we're gonna to try to do the vegan shrimp that we used to do, Riley challenged us. And he liked the shrimp we made last time, but he said he really missed when Sherry used to make shrimp with just like some Obey seasoning on it. So we're gonna to try to do that. So we're gonna start with a base of grapeseed oil, which fry, can fry at very high temperatures. Garlic powder, seaweed, black pepper. Huh. <laughs> Go ahead, give it to Nori Komi. Nori Komi Furry Kaki. Yeah, and that's for a seafood taste. Please just give it like a seafood Nori taste. Nori Komi Furry Kaki. Okay. Um, lemons. We're going to use the brine from these capers. We're going to use a little bit of egg replacer. Club soda. Fish fry batter. Make sure it's vegan. And a little salt and pepper. <laughs> but where's the... Oh. And this Old Bay, which is going to give us that classic seafood flavor, especially for people Where's from Ryan? Maryland. Ryan, where are you at? Tell me how you feel about the Old Bay. Gotta come in here. I like me some Old Bay. <laughs> no, he really does. <laughs> so the shrimp challenge came from him. All right. Are we ready? Yeah, and then we're going to have some spicy marinara that I got at the grocery store on sale. Organic, yeah, spicy yeah, yeah, for our calamari. I have the same one. And we'll see. Yeah? We'll, we'll see what's happening. You got to put your glasses on. Uh, there you go. Hey. Hi. We'll see if you it can passes. ask me what it's like at 55. Yeah, we'll, we'll see if it passes the non vegan test at the end. The shrimp, you said it had to have a certain texture, right? Like when you have it, what it makes you oh, like it? Right. Mainly a taste. So the taste has to be the old bay, right? Okay. And then the texture, I guess, it has to be like. Not I mean, slimy. I think you got the, the texture pretty good. Last the one? only thing is, like, you gotta make sure that it goes through the whole thing and it's not that's just on the outside. marinating. Okay. That's the okay. marinating. Okay. Yeah, that's why right. you gotta marinate it for two hours. That's something I realized too is, like, once I, once I, like, bit into it, I saw all the white mm -hmm. things, and usually it's like. You can be honest. Okay, he's like, so you gotta marinate the shrimp. <laughs> These vegan shrimp, you gotta marinate them for two hours. Yeah. Any sort of vegan product, it's best to marinate them for a good amount of time. Yeah. Riley's a good judge, because Sherry, me, and Kara have been vegan for so long. Sometimes we get mesmerized by vegan food, and we're like, yeah, you know, you know what I mean? Like, it's been so long, we get like kind of fooled. Yeah. Riley still eats normal, so he we test it on him. If he says, we're like, okay, all right, we can put it on other people. <laughs> but we want him to be honest because he's a really good judge and therefore yeah. we can bring you guys a very honest opinion. Yeah. No, literally my dad and I was like, okay, we're going to do a family barbecue. And he was like, okay, we're going to do a bunch of vegan stuff, all this stuff. And, my, and he was like, okay, tell your brother to go get like his favorite steak. Yeah. And then I said that to my brother and he was like, no. I see, he can see the chicken. He wants the vegan no, chicken. No. <laughs> <laughs> anyway. Let's get started cooking, yeah, right? Are we ready? Did you need to take my dogs in there? Yeah, so dogs out back. I don't, I don't even need the ranch for this. I was uh, looking for him this whole time. I want to eat Are we ready to start cooking? All right, Riley. <laughs> what are you doing? What? Are we ready to start cooking? We're still filming. Yes. Wait, right, are we ready to start cooking? Yes. Okay, I'm let's here. do it. I need, I need some, some energy to cook. So oh. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna. It smells so good. Yeah, it smells like. All right, don't drool over it. Is that soy you put on it? No, it's like my mm. own kind of. It smells like a soy. Like the a recipe soy. for this is on your spicy vegan. Mm -hmm. Y'all gotta sure keep All right. No, they're they're, they're warm. They're warm and they're best oh, they room are. temperature. Oh, like after you cook them and then they cool off a little bit, that's when so you good. pull the stick right out. Mm. And the stick is sugar cane. Yummy. So oh, oh, <laughs> oh! Oh, oh, oh my God. God. He said his finger looking good. He said I'll take it right off the. Oh, yeah. Right. Coconut bone. <laughs> okay, we're gonna finish these and we're gonna get the cooking. Oh. All right, so you're yelling at me, asking me if I'm ready. Now you're like, wait, I'm eating. What are you talking about? I'm saying that. All right, because I need you to now. open these. I right. can't get them open. Do they fight, you ask? <laughs> uh, so the first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna open these and drain the water that they're sitting in, and then we're gonna slice them up. I'm gonna show you how to do that. Derek, I need you to open this. Yeah. Or Kira, or Riley, or someone who doesn't have slimy hands. 
you got the string. Let's see who's gonna open it first. Oh. Oh. Yeah, my fingers are there. I need this. <laughs> oh, you didn't get all that stuff together before you. Hold on. Hold on. Wait. Oh, Lord. It's really tight. It's, that's what she said. <laughs> Mother! You got it? Mine here is for the, it's for the money. I was on the hey, challenge. Hey, so, so Mine here is for the challenge. <laughs> of course, we need a daddy to do it. Daddy to do it. We need a daddy to do it. <laughs> Vegan. I'm so bad right Vegan now. Vegan strong. Vegan strong. <laughs> Riley, you need to go to the gym more, bro. <laughs> Riley. Excuse me. You need to go to the gym, mate. <laughs> Say it one more time. Come on, baby. I believe in you. All right, you I, get, I get to do the next try if you, you don't get it. It's this hand. All right, give me another towel. It's slipping. No, I, I know what the problem is. I'm sweating over here. Y'all got cameras and lights. <laughs> For sure, Marcus. <laughs> 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 All right, let's go. I'm sweating so bad right now. Oh my god, this is hot. And it's open. And it's open. <laughs> my hands were slipping. So now what we're gonna do is we're just going to go over to the sink and drain these. <laughs> here, drain one. All right, I got it. All right, so we're gonna just gonna drain out the liquid. We're just going to be cutting these into, let's say, half inch pieces. What we're gonna do with them is we're gonna just poke out the middle so that we have a calamari ring. Oh. And then you can just use that as like one of the we're little pieces. We're gonna fry pieces. that up too. You can fry this up too, you can yeah. stick it in your salad. And we're just gonna do that with all these. Do you guys have a chopstick? That'd be perfect to poke it through. So if you have a it's chopstick a or a straw, a yeah, star. you can just push. Of course, care with the You can just push the middle through. This is actually I want it to be a little bigger than that. You think that's okay? Yeah. All right. So we'll just go with that. All right, so we are getting some pretty proper looking calamari hearts of palm pieces right here. It looks like the real thing. It really does. I'm you like, guys might say, oh, that will real. taste like the real thing, We're but at this point, it. at this point in the process, you can't say that that doesn't look like the real thing. We have the looks down, then on our scale of vegan but not vegan, we have the looks, I think, at a 10 right now, then we're gonna have taste and texture. Do you guys think it's a 10? Can I see that piece again? What? Tell me that says it's not vegan. It yeah, Tell me that doesn't look like calamari. She's over there, she wants to see it. The other way you know that I would say. I'm talking about this one. Let me see it, let me see it closer. She said, I'm talking about look. this one. <laughs> look from right there, don't no, be all like up in its grill. That looks like calamari. Come check, come check about Riley, get on. Get out of my face. 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 I don't know what you're saying. I've done this. You watch me on set what? do it. Which one? Zigzag, cross the floor, the kids shuffle pop. in line. Kids pop. Yes! I don't remember that song, though. Let's see, it needs to be a bigger hole. Yeah, it needs to be a bigger hole, yeah. Some of them pop out. All right, we'll, we'll be back it. after all of these are popped out. <laughs> I'm enjoying myself, actually. I like this type of stuff. You like tedious projects. I do. So I really do. I actually really enjoy Eric it. Eric always does the tedious things. I like it. All right, T. <laughs> so my parents, because I took a little mini break, did the whole calamari, calamari situation. I'm, so they look like calamari now. So now all we have to do is marinate them and then cook them. And we'll see how we're it tastes. Them. How long are we going to marinate them for? At least an hour. Okay. Oh, we're wow. gonna marinate that for an hour, but then we're gonna do our shrimp right after that. Let's go! Let's do it. We're gonna start our marinade with a little bit of blended oil of canola and grapeseed oil. Add a little lemon. Do you have a lemon squeezer thing? Ooh, that smells good. We're gonna use the brine, about a tablespoon or two. Brine? The brine is what the capers are swimming in. I want to see. Okay, now I'm gonna put a couple capers in there because they have a real 
C kind of flavor. Black pepper, put a good amount in there. Garlic powder. Old Bay. It already smells good. Oh, a lot of Old Bay. Yep, about two tablespoons. That is more than two tablespoons. Yes. Like, no, it's not. <laughs> We're gonna take this Nori Como Furikake, which is gonna give a seafoody taste as well. This has black sesame seeds, white sesame seeds, black seaweed, and powdered sesame seed. I'm gonna put like one, two. Then to amp up the seafood flavor, we're gonna use the spicy nori strips, which is seaweed. And all we're gonna do is we're gonna take them out and we're gonna crumble them up. Just rip them up as little as you can. Doesn't have to be perfect. It's nice to get that little taste of seaweed in there. We're just gonna mix it all together and we're gonna give it a little taste. You always, always, always want to taste your journey. Sure, I can taste the old bay. It's just like that perfect mm. spicy kick. I can taste the it. lemon, the old bay. <laughs> That's what happens with the good seaweed. Food it's good. Real Riley, right, want to taste? No, Riley. No, I don't want Riley to taste it. <laughs> so what do we do now? <laughs> so now we're going to put. We're gonna put equal amount, mm -hmm. but we got to be real tender, yeah. marinating yeah. that. I'll so, do that. I'll move that around once you pour this, it. Out, this we want to be a little rough with. This we want to yeah. really like, like you should have clean hands and really massage it into yeah. the shrimp. Yeah, this one, I mean, I'll do that one. I'll all right, so I'll do it. So I'm okay. gonna let you do that, Derek. I'm gonna let you think stop. Well, just, okay, I'm gonna take this. Part. I think you should do it, Mom. Yeah, let me do it. I think you're being all weird. I got it, I got it. Just move and stop. Okay. Good job. Uh-huh. Hold on. Can you use a little more? I feel like we should more. Well, let's see what it looks like once you get it all over it, you know? It doesn't need to be floating in, it just needs to be covered in okay. it. Okay. Alright, so I gotta, I'm gonna take this and this very gentle. Well, you do that one. Okay. You wanna be really gentle, because these are fragile. So Derek's using this rubber spoon, which doesn't cut through them, which is great. He's scooping from the bottom and not pressing into it, but under it and then rolling the seasoning around. Mm. See, I like to smash and mush stuff and, uh, and I like to be he likes to be gentle with the fragile things. I don't have time for all that. But one of us is to think. This looks really good. I'm gonna put actually in this another lemon in it. Very excited. Very excited? She's very, she's very excited. Food has always been such a major part of our family get-togethers and our family celebrations. <laughs> and who out there does not feel like that about food? Food is always just such, it just evokes so many memories, right? Yep. And now we've just found out how to make healthier versions of it. Alrighty, so we're all done with seasoning and now we're gonna leave it in the mic. No. So we're gonna marinate for a minimum of one hour, but mm -hmm. you really can do this and just leave it overnight. The more you marinate it, you do it for two days even. The more you marinate it, the more flavor gets into, into your vegan food. <laughs> That's on our that's on our YouTube channel, by the way. This is the recipe for this right here. Hey, 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 guys! All right, I'm gonna be honest with you. We were hanging out on it was a Saturday, or Sunday. This is a whole like day later. We got tired and we decided we would do the calamari a different day. Everybody's here, they're over there chatting. And we're gonna cook it up, then they're gonna try it on camera for us. The moral of the story is we are human. We all got tired. And so when we run out of time, we just finish shooting the next day or the day after, whatever serves us. Kira is there as another vegan. Janice and Riley are not vegans. So they're gonna be the real test. They will try. They will try. And, and they will be honest. Yeah, yeah. So try here's it. the thing though, with this vegan shrimp, Normal shrimp you just boil or steam mm. with seasoning, Gold Bay and whatever. But he didn't like the texture of mm. doing that, so we're trying to create a, a like a snappier, shrimpier texture. Mm. There's one on our lip. Oh, no. no. <laughs> Whatever chance he gets, I'll tell you. Yeah. But um, <laughs> so we're gonna try to create like a more shrimpy texture. So what I'm gonna do is we marinated it. We're going to pan fry it until the edges all the way around get nice and crispy. Mm -hmm. All right, so we're gonna come over here to our hot saute pan. This already had oil mixed into the seasoning. 
And we want to do a single layer. I love the silver Because we want to get browning on all sides. All right, doing. so we're going to start with that. We're going to just move this around in batches so that all sides get a char on them, a burn. So, so good, and it smells it smells good. so good. Now what we're going to do over here is we're going to create a wet batter and then a dry batter for the vegan calamari. And then we're going to fry it over here in the oil. For our wet batter, we're going to start out with a simple tempura batter mix. And you just want to make sure that it's vegan because a lot of them have milk and eggs in them. But you want to take out this batter mix. We're going to put it in our bowl. We're going to season them both with the same thing. So mm -hmm. then I'm going to put my panko breadcrumbs, that's going to be the dry coating, on the top. We're going to season both of these with Old Bay. Never can get it too much Old Bay. This has a lot of salt in it, so no need to add any extra salt. Some garlic powder. A dusting, as you say. <laughs> a dusting. Black pepper. That's where I'm playing the guitar over there, if you guys remember. Love that. Time to tune in it. For our wet batter, we're going to use a little bit of egg replacer. There, you'll put the I'm going to put all the measurements down below in the description box. For that seafood flavor, we're going to get our seaweed again, our nori seaweed. We are going to just, with our fingers, just break up little pieces. Now we're going to keep these moving. And we want to make sure that there's no um, liquid left and that everything looks really dry. Mm -hmm. And after we've moved it around, we're going to keep on going until they start to brown. So this is the dry mixture and we're just going to incorporate all of the seasonings. I love panko because it's lighter, it's crispier. And this is going to be our tempura batter. Mm. which is also a lighter batter. That's where tempura is. Tempura, tempura, yeah. So tempura we're going to hungry. incorporate all of the seasoning that we put in. And then instead of cold water, which is what most of these box batter mixes call for, we're going to use club soda. Club soda Why? makes it very light and fluffy. So we're going to put about three quarters of a cup in there, but let's see what happens. I'll show you the consistency we're after. We're actually gonna put way more than three quarters of a cup. And you wanna incorporate your club soda slowly so that it doesn't get too loose, but then you don't want it to be too thick because then it will break up our very delicate vegan calamari, which is made out of um, hearts of palm. All right, let's come over here and give the shrimp a little t a little turn. See how it's looking. How good is that, it's back and forth. So this is looking pretty good. So it's gonna look like pancake batter. That's the consistency we're going for, is pancake batter. So it's really going to be about taking oh, our part. calamari, mm -hmm. popping them in this batter. So now what we're going to do is we're going to coat each of these, each of these little vegan calamari with the batter. The tedious part is that you want to be gentle with these guys. So you can either use chopsticks, which I am not good at. It's like, oh my goodness. All right, so then. It's one of the puppies. That we looks wanna, like calamari. Yeah, we want to cover these, make sure the hole is still mm -hmm. there, and then we want to fry them. All right, so they get done very fast. So you want to make sure that once they're done, you put them in a single layer. But I want to get these guys all on paper towel so that there's no excess oil because who wants greasy? Also, we discovered that we are going to try a different technique about getting the coating of the, the breadcrumbs on the batter because what we realize is that's a big pain in the butt to, to take it from this to this. So we're gonna put all this in a plastic bag and put these in it and shake it up to see what we get. Here we go. Experiment two. So here's our bag. I always roll over the outside edges. That have to have a little crumbs we gotta clean up, is that right? And I feel like this batter probably has to be a little thinner. Yes. So you're, she will adjust it in the recipe. Yeah. What'd you do? So this, I added a little more, um, so we want thin 
pancake mix because then it falls through the hole. Okay. The other one was kind of getting caught. It wasn't yeah. falling through the hole. So now we have it in the bag and we're just very gently shaking it around. <laughs> And we're gonna get it out of here. That is much better than doing it the other way. Yeah. Much better. Going in. Yay. See, we're learning right alongside Together. you guys. All because I miss calamari. Ha! <laughs> With the frying. Sherry's not gonna allow me to have too much of it, but every now and then for a treat, she's okay with it. Because frying is no bueno, but you know, you gotta have a little something, something right here. Mm -hmm. A little something, something as a vegan. Okay. Here's the next batch. I didn't let it get as dark, because there's no reason to. So I turned down my temperature a little bit. Okay, I think that we're good. See, this is what we want. We want this charred color. We want it to be really dry so that there's more of a crispy outside. See that right there? Yep, yep. So our shrimp is done. Our calamari is done. So now we're gonna have a taste test with the kiddos. All right, let's do it. All right, guys, here we go. Taste test. We're gonna go first. Wait, first, you yeah. wanna put all the lemon, like sprinkle yeah. lemon on there. Lemon on there. I'm, gonna show, I'm gonna show you how to do that. Hold on, let's do We have vegan shrimp and vegan calamari yes. that my parents made. Yes. This is the proper way to squeeze a lemon over <laughs> your food. Fork, <laughs> middle, uh -huh. stab, cup, so you don't spray anyone. And put over it. Oh, no. Hello. <laughs> what we're gonna do over here for the calamari. Hold it for you. We're gonna say fork, middle, cup, and judge. Okay. Yeah! I wanna shoot. What was that? My favorite movie. It's not. 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 Okay. Okay. Riley, you have to do it with us. I ain't doing that. All right, here we go. He's scared. I can tell he's scared. Well, I feel it. You're vegan, like it. so hold on now, girl. Yeah, let's let the non vegan try first. Let's pick one. Pick that crispy one, right? Boy, there. it's not scary. Right. <laughs> you have to say your honest Dip opinion. Dip is, this, is this actual like cocktail sauce or yes. is this yes. vegan cocktail sauce? No, no, no actual. actual cocktail sauce. All vegan. Cocktail sauce. All cocktail sauces. Yeah, I was gonna say, isn't it just all sauce? Yeah. Yeah? Yeah, what? Yeah. It tastes pretty damn thing. <laughs> oh, mother, yeah. you're spraying me with juices. Well, it's almost a little bit more like chicken. Lemon. Uh, but, or maybe crab. Okay, yeah, that's right? in the seafood family. Oh, okay. yeah. yeah. It's looks like, it's it's looks like crab. It's seafood family. Oh, okay. oh, we're good. It looks like crab, that's it. Oh. I mean, took the one I was going to take, girl. It's pretty damn girl. good. Yum. How do you try it? I was never really a shrimpy person. I haven't had a real shrimp in a while, but that's pretty good. Just going for seconds. Yeah, you go up a second. That's the true fact. Cause you would be like, eh. Yeah, 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 yeah. And then I could get like crispier, closer to it. Yeah. Okay. That looks like yeah. calamari, but yeah. it's vegan. Yeah. It's such not vegan. Spicy, right? Janice just went back in from seconds with the of the shrimp. Mm-hmm. Let me see. Jay, do you eat calamari? Do you try it? I'm trying. Try it now. Mm -hmm. Rai Rai and Jay are non-vegans. Not as good. Not as good. Um, so I just, I've fried food, I love fried what food. What is it? You know, hearts of palm. Hearts of palm. Mmm, yeah. <laughs> you like, what do you say? What do you say? What do you say? What do you hit the back like in my throat right here, pause? That's hearts like, of palm. <laughs> Calamari. It's like super rubbery, chewy, like calamari. Yeah, yeah. A lot of people don't like how chewy calamari is. I do, but like That's people, right. I remember eating it, people be like, oh, it's like rubber bands. This gives me that feeling and that taste totally. without the chew, without the chewy calamari. Mm -hmm. I like this more than the shrimp. Same. Yeah. Texturally, I like, I like this more than the shrimp. I like the shrimp, I think more. I like the shrimp more. Really? Oh. Okay. So there you have it. Yeah. Honest opinion. Not vegan. Not vegan. Vegans, one likes shrimp. One likes the vegans. calamari. Yeah. But both get a thumbs Which up. Which one do you care? The calamari, but I love calamari. Like yeah. I'm a yeah. calamari. Yeah. Yeah. Calamari. Yeah. calamari. I'm a calamari girl. All right. So guys, try this recipe. We're going to keep Whoa. playing with it. But you guys know what to do. If you like this video, tell them what to do, honey. Subscribe, y'all. Yeah. Hey. Share this. Share this with your friends and family, with your besties, trying to get on that health kick right along with you. Leave us some love in the comments. Hit that notifications <laughs> bell so that when we post a video every single week, you're yep. the first to know. 
Be an OG, y'all. And guess what? This is our baby channel. Yeah. And if you enjoyed this video, you know what to do. Go watch Go another watch one. Go watch more. This we have 300, 300 more to watch. And most importantly, guys, thank you so much. We love you, love you, love you. We're so happy that you're part of our community. Let's change the world the right way. one no, mouth this way. at a time. We're going to go back to eating, guys. Just love you. Say bye, bye. guys. I like the trip. Shake it from a baby, wonder can you make it clap? Control me, fight it, tap, tap, tap. I'm grabbing on your hips, hit it from the back. Control me, fight it, tap, tap, tap. Shake it from a baby, come on, shake it from me, yeah. Shake it from a baby, come on, shake it from me, yeah. Shake it from a baby, come on, shake it from me, yeah. Shake it from a baby, come on, shake it from me, yeah. Shake it from me, baby, make that ass an earthquake. No debate, wanna see you what you need your worst way. Picking up a bottle, cause I know you like some dust. My belly like a model, it's a mask, gotta fake it, eh? Real, she a 10, better than a bench, she gon' shake when I'm a feeling like